Hey everyone! In today's video, we'll be sharing with you our top five tips for buying a faja. Tip two, what compression level is it? The next thing to consider is the compression level of the faja. The compression level refers to how tight the faja will be on your body. This will ultimately determine how much support and shaping you get from the faja. If you're using a faja as a recovery garment after surgery, it's important to follow your surgeon's instructions on what compression level to wear during each stage of recovery. Typically, for stage one of recovery, you'll want to wear a low compression faja as your body is still healing and needs gentle support. For stage two, a high compression garment will provide the necessary support as you continue to heal. And for stage three, a medium compression faja can help maintain your progress and provide comfort as you return to your normal activities. Regardless of the stage of recovery, make sure you choose a faja with the appropriate compression level to ensure your comfort and healing. If you're new to fajas, it's best to start with a medium compression level and work your way up as your body becomes more accustomed to wearing a faja. Remember, finding the right faja can take some time, but with these tips in mind, you'll be well on your way to finding the perfect faja for you. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.